JaVale McGee, JaVale McGee's Parking Lot Chronicles. We just beat the Portland Trail Blazers. Great game, and uh, let's get to it. We gotta get some stuff. <laughs> Lucas, you know what I'm saying? This is JaVale McGee once again with a special guest, Parking Lot Chronicles, Draymond Green. Draymond, say what's up to what the up? people. Parking Lot Chronicles, man, I'm happy to be here. Big facts, you're the best at least top three trash talker in the league. We, the fans want to know, they asked me this question, what is the art of trash talking? Like, how are you just, how's it just in your blood to get under people's skin like that? All right, so number one, you you just can't, like, you, it don't matter how somebody feel, you know what I'm saying? So like, if, if he take it personal, he take it personal. If he want to take it off the court, he take it off the court. Like, I don't really care how you feel after I say something. Number two is like, nothing's off limits for me. You know, so like, if, <laughs> if you have a problem off the court, I may bring that up, you know? Facts. It's like, you gotta know some facts about people exactly. off the court to where you bring that on the court you gotta, and then it, You gotta do your research. Exactly. I'll tell you when I know I got a guy, when he like, you can't get in my head. Yeah, I got you, G. <laughs> <laughs> you done already. I got you on there me. There it is head. right there. Shout out to Willie over there. What up, Willie? Hey, right, just come get a cameo real quick. Willie just say G. what up real quick. Young Willie, assistant coach, doing his thing. Been doing his thing. Willie shot, man. Shot. <laughs> Good, bro. You already know, bro. You already know. You good? Yeah, you already know. It's a little cold out here to have your shirt on. Oh, man. we ain't. <laughs> <laughs> this is a pretty big car. I'm surprised you don't fit in there. I know. It's not my fault, though. I was, bo I was born this way. <laughs> you good, man? You already know. I'm doing good. Sorry you don't fit in. <laughs> Sorry I'm seven foot. What car you fit in? I got the Maybach right there. <laughs> I fit perfectly, I promise. All right, another question. On your way to the game, or even post-game, what's on your playlist? Oh, man, so post-game, I'm straight Luther Vandross. Okay. I know I got a whole list. <laughs> Young Luther, OK. So I go from Joe Good Girls. Then from Good Joe Good Girls, I go to uh, Casey and JoJo, Tell Me It's Real. Old, old school R&B, OK. Then I go from Tell Me It's Real to Casey and JoJo all my life. <laughs> okay. And after all my life, I go to Kelly Price, friend of mine. <laughs> then after friend of mine, we straight loot the greatest hits, baby. Wow. What is one thing no one has ever asked you? Something may happen on the court, and it's like people are quick to judge you. They're quick to say this. They're quick to say that. You know, they're quick to write this article. They never stop. But and they ask. never stop and ask. Why? Why did that happen? Yeah. Like, why did you do that? It's never like a thing. It's just always people jumping to conclusions. Have a good night, my guy. Thanks, man. I appreciate you having me, brother. You already know, bro. Today is kind of crazy because I came out here. It was already a super fan just waiting. Like, is that the parking lot Chronicles? So I had no choice but to bring him out here. Let's introduce yourself to the to the people out there in TV land. Uh, hi, my name is Daniel Kim. I am um, founder of Lit Motors. I'm a San Francisco resident for the last seven years. Seven um, years. What is your favorite Warriors moment this season? And why do you love coming to Warrior games? Uh, I think my favorite moment was watching the Warriors bench reaction to Jordan Bell doing that self alley you yeah. to himself. I was like, Dr like <laughs> Draymond was like, yeah! And um, Curry was like, <laughs> 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 like Durant was like, yeah, definitely. By far, we have the best bench celebrations. Yeah, and like every time you throw up an alley -oop, you you do an alley -oop. It's awesome. Appreciate um, that. Yeah, I think you're, Facts. you're you're like you like are the energy starter. You're like the fire starter. You know it. I'm, I I'm, that's, that's why I should be the spokesperson for Lit Motors. You see what I'm saying? I'm always lit. You see how that goes? I appreciate you. Yeah, thank you so much. Honestly and truly. And now I'm famous. You see, you're gonna be famous. Yeah. You get like three hundred thousand views a week. Hey, 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 just say what's up, man. What's up? What you eating, man? Some pasta and some food for my dog. Some, some pasta and food for my dog. You yeah. feed your dog pasta? No, no, I got some pork loin in here. Oh. You not? feeding your dog swine, my brother? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See, Mama, Mama Loon coming. Hey, hey this, just in case y'all know, love, this Mama Loon. And I love JaVale McGee. Shout out to Mama He the Loon. original <laughs> diva of the NBA. I'm a diva. That's all I'm saying. That's how good you is, yeah. you know? I'm and you still good look good. Dog. You know when you find oh, yeah, all the divas. Oh, yeah, like, I'm saying, you, you look good. 
Love you, man. Appreciate it. And Love tell you your too. mama I said hi. I will. All right. Thank you. Thank you for tuning in. It's your boy JaVel McGee, Parking Lot Chronicles, episode five. It's a wrap.